All right, come on in, hit the like button, think about subscribing if already. If you're new here, welcome to the channel, but most importantly, welcome to the Viking family. So this is my personal opinion slash review for the 2023 comedy film live action of Barbie. Here's the plot. Barbie and Ken are having the time of their lives in a colorful and seemingly perfect world of Barbie land. However, when they get a chance to go to the real world, they soon discover the joys and pearls of living among humans. Now, here is some of the cast. This was such a super odd, but also fun time. It was definitely really out there with how much they went in with the, the dedication to the Barbie satire. To the point I fr frankly never want to hear the word Barbie ever again. Hi Barbie. Hi Barbie. Hi Barbie. Hi Barbie. Hi Barbie. Hi Barbie. There's always been this old pop culture thing about roasting Ken, about him being this weak, insecure, dumb, pointless, side character doll. I definitely got a, a huge kick out of that throughout most of the film. However, they unfortunately lost me, lost my care about Ken and the interest of the film for about 20-30 minutes when this Ken started causing problems. But they came back around at the end when you get the typical family film conclusion ending. Definitely they threw in jokes made about a uh, Barbie world, uh, then bring you down to the real world where things are not as colorful and show you the ugliness. They even went at the company itself, which Will, Fer Will, Will Ferrell was the CEO uh, and of, and he wasn't funny to me in this in my opinion and i haven't really seen things in the past five years that with him in it that where he was funny where he is back in his prime so i mean and that's just my opinion uh but margot robbie was such a good actress to pick for this film so even they kind of made fun of that part of it uh in there uh, her portrayal was very detailed with her little placements of her body movements, including her emotional changes while still being a bubbly, positive, stiff Barbie doll. I will say, it I didn't understand at all how the connection worked between the real world and the Barbie world. It wasn't explained that much to me uh, in general to, or to the audience. Um, maybe I missed something, but I, you know, I was paying attention pretty good, and I. I think this kind of got a lazy and kind of brushed through it a little bit, but here's my right now come out my fault thoughts. It was a fun film 90% of the time with plenty of shots thrown at both genders uh, and lots of throwbacks in Barbie history that double as roasting as of Mattel's uh, history, company's history. But they killed the mood with the Kens towards the end, I will say. But definitely love Margot Robbie so much throughout every bit of this film. Despite my rating, I really had a fun time. I liked a lot of it. It's just that when they went with the Ken's towards the end, the 20 30 minutes, it kind of just for me kind of derailed a bit of the fun of it. Um, you know, and I, I'm not going to get into the, the, the whole controversy about it because I really don't care, and that's not what my channel is about, but it's just. I don't know if it's that or if it's just. You know, this something about that whole thing was just uh, kind of like went a different direction than what the rest of the film was, is what I'm really trying to say. Um, but, um, yeah, it wasn't a bad film, though. It, it was just, if you go into it with, with, em with the empty mind, low expectations, or even just like mid mid expectations, it's actually a really fun family film. Definitely directed more towards young ladies. Um, but, and... Older adults, in fact, that are, are women that, uh, you know, grew up with these, these dolls. Um, but uh, obviously not towards me. So either way, it's, it's, it's not towards me. But 
And it was a fun film. It was. It has some issues with it, um, but it had a lot of uh, odds and ends of really, really pushing it out there with how odd this can be and how kind of weird in a good way. Uh, but what are your guys' thoughts? Um, let me know in the comments below. Um, I'm hoping to have something out tomorrow, but we'll see. Um, but remember, I love you all. Please stay safe. Uh, remember to love everyone, no matter what. And skull.